Hello, folks. We're here tonight at At The Table, and we have nothing else to film, so we're going to film. go back to an old classic. Ask the czar three questions. Oh, so we'll let God. Tony ask the first question. It's more of a serious one. How do, how do you think your army would fare against everybody else's army? In War, War Machine. Machine. Well, we haven't in played Hordes. it. I know, I'm just saying. Uh, what, are you, what are your predictions on once my army gets painted and we actually start playing? I'm not sure that, because you have the stuff that has continuous fire. Um, Robbie's probably just going to, like, run his guys around, like, space invaders or something. So I'm not so... Or he'll, like... But what army do you need to uh, figure out with him? Which army do you want him to play? His circle or his uh, Keldor to ask this question? Well, let's see both perspectives. So that was Kador or what? Well, Kador, it's just a matter of seeing how how much the speed um, hurts them. Um, with the circle, is, um, they have more of their you know, teleporty and their speed <laughs> stuff. So was, I remember from last time when we played it, it's basically a um, matter of getting that you know, opening to run up to the um, Warcaster and just um, maul it. Oh, that's your... Hordes guys with the wolves. Yeah. I hate those wolves. That's all I remember was I hated those wolves. <laughs> but what about against Ro Robbie's army? Well, what army? Well, uh, that should be the the answer. What army? The elves, the Gadar. There's only four Gadar in it. Five Gadar in his entire <laughs> army. That's not enough to really make an, a theoretical answer to that question. Mm -hmm. I mean, do Starbox to starter box at least. But the thing about that, though, is that he doesn't have much range, so he has to actually has to get up close, which would kind of hurt him there. Unless his... Because I think his caster has a decent attack spell, but that's about... And I think his heavy has a range shot. I mean, he might be... Because my guys only go four, so he might be able to, like, kite them with it, but it would be take a long time. Cause no, he can't shot. kite them. I'll tell you right off the bat. Oh, okay. I painted them and put them together. <laughs> And I painted and put yours together. <laughs> no, mention. he can't. Not, not to mention Robbie's... Robbie's entire box rides on a force shield. Robbie's box didn't get upgraded since the last box. <laughs> Tells you the company hates him. <laughs> not, not the army itself, just Robbie. They hate Robbie. They could tell. No, they knew Robbie was going to buy it, so they... <laughs> they, sabotaged they, it. they saw it reflected in the bald elf chick's um, Robbie's, shiny head. Robbie's best chance is to play his Signar. Yeah. That he lost in his room. At mean, least that way he has a balance of range and force. Yeah. The, the elves only had a force field going for him, and the uh, commander in the Warjack guy is just a mech uh, repairer. And with Signar, you can always at least, you have you have Striker's Earthquake spell to save you. Does that, give, does that knock down units or something? That's the thing. It knocked down your units, remember? Yeah. But like I said, mm -hmm. the elves is the force field. And he was riding the force field until I told him, they're just going to run up close and personal and beat the shit out of you. It basically gives them one free hit because <coughs> it's six hit points on a light and ten on a heavy, I believe. And if you knock out his arc node, the that node cuts Robbie's uh, yeah, the range generator. down. Oh, yeah, and that's... So Robbie has more points of weakness than the standard army. Other than Robbie playing it, of course. Yeah. His only strong one, I think, is just Signar, which gives him the range for once things start Also, too, he has the experience of what him and Jim played in Old Man Mike together experience that you know he should learn from but obviously but the problem is he doesn't have the one of the mechs from uh signar that he played a mine which was the uh, light cannoneer so instead of, instead of you know spending money to get this gift from australia for his mom he could have gotten himself the actual part he needed for a somewhat functional army but more capable than somebody else or hands. he could have got everblight and then he could have ripped everything apart like old man Mike did to his army until Mike Robbie got the chain gun guy of mine. Well, it's too bad, Robbie. Yeah. So, Robbie, we can't see you. We don't want to see you. <laughs> what is your question to Brandon? Get in front of the camera, Robbie. Brandon, do you think there's any hope for me at all? That's not a I'm question. Not no. That is not a question that okay. you being narcissistic. Okay. And besides, we no, the, the, the correct question is, Robbie, no, Brandon. Okay, I'm kind of fit into that. <laughs> you do fit into that because you can fit into Brandon, Robbie. Oh, oh God, <laughs> all the way around. Okay. This is why a correct question you should ask. This week. Brandon, <laughs> <laughs> what is my sister's boob sizes? Each one. <laughs> <laughs> That's a Robbie question. Okay. 
Okay, but Robbie, now ask a question that has logic to it. Like, challenge Brandon. Like, okay, Brandon. What's his bra size? <laughs> <laughs> that is a good question. Well, not that challenging, but. It's, it was challenging enough for him to be going hee 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 over it. Oh, yes. That, that's... So, Brandon's got to answer it or no, truth no, or dare. I, I, think, I think it's more challenging for him to ask it and breathe at the same time. Just, Which one, Mal- Robbie? Mouth breathing yeah. the question after it was following a Katie question. And he goes, "I'm not that creative, so I take Russ's idea and then yeah. attach, switch out the names like Mad Libs." Yeah. Uh, yes, he's so clever. He was, he was do, you know, he was doing this <laughs> over it. So, so either uh, Brandon cannot answer it, and then Robbie wins, or just answer it, and then put Robbie in his place. <laughs> we need to make for Tony him have the Jeopardy music now. Yeah. Oh, Tony's going to get the Jeopardy music oh, for God. you. I don't know. Um, I don't know. Those Supersized? A sure. Triple D? I don't think quite that, but sure. Well, triple D wide to go with the shirt size? Uh, yeah. Because you told me you wide a wide's over at JC Penney's. I mean, the tall. <laughs> wide's, well, I mean, wide's You're wide the, framed. You're wider, you're, you're well, shoulder, I mean, between shoulder to shoulder. Yeah. I mean, that's just the normal, um, extra large. <laughs> uh, how do you like it when it happens to you, Brandon, <laughs> playing the music box? <laughs> the countdown's a nice set, sir. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know his legal answer. Am I right, Tony? Because he doesn't wear a bra. He is. He is. I never did question. Okay. What, what is I don't know? What is I haven't been sized? <laughs> okay. Are you happy with that answer? Yes, I am. <laughs> and, and <he's... laughs> we can ask Brandon a nice question, like how many different ways you would like to kill Robbie after that question? Or did you enjoy answering that question? Did you enjoy feeling yourself up during this question? Uh. <laughs> you know, stopping to look and go, I don't know. Yeah, I never realized. I never realized it. <laughs> but should we let Tony or Robbie ask the next question? What do you think, Brandon? Or do you want me to? Right. Which would be the worst of the three fates? I'm... Curious to see if Robbie can come up with something else, or if he's just going to Mad Lib another one. Okay, well, this is actually a question I've always wanted to ask. Oh, God. This so should you be interesting. Where's your shoe side? No, 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 no. Okay. What's your favorite... What your favorite? <laughs> what's your favorite version of me dying that you've written? Oh. We've asked that question before. Have we? Yes. Yeah, it was, uh... The one where you got dra- get dragged. You ever notice that other? every single question is about him? Is about him. Okay. Yeah. What well, the fuck's wrong with Robbie? That's my question. What the fuck is wrong with Robbie? Every single question is about Robbie. Every single question is uh, what is wrong with Robbie? Well, every single question is do you love Robbie? Every single question is do you ship Robbie with someone? It's his favorite subject. He needs. He needs. I know. Re- information. Shut up. Okay. And for the record, it's still the one where you get, you know, dragged into the arena and executed by the ponies in graphic fashion. Okay. I thought it was the one where Jeff put him in a hole, lit him on fire. <laughs> that, was, that one has its place, too, because it was, like, the first one. Or the one where Sam and Dean kicks the door down <laughs> and then goes, <laughs> and boom. Or the one where he gets resurrected from hell and they go, oh, my God, there's a ghost. Sam and Dean shoot him again. <laughs> So how can you ask a question about something that... that I don't know. What... <laughs> that, so you ask about the one topic you don't know about, Robbie? <laughs> I, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I was like, yeah, let's ask Robbie three questions. That will be the dumbest qu- answers in the world. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I think I can answer this one. Josh. Uh, Which Josh? I don't know. There's more than one? I thought he just lost a whole lot of weight and tied his hair. And was bald. Oh, wait, they're both going bald. <sighs> uh. Any last words, Brandon? Um, Since Robbie has thoroughly embarrassed himself with Robbiness and tried to embarrass you with bra sizes. 
<laughs> when he could have asked you an endless question. So, if we played Warhammer again, do you think I have a chance of beating you now? It's a Robbie question, but it's a good question. Because Robbie still has orcs that die horribly. Yeah. That Tony has, has captured so many times. <laughs> Maybe they learned something in their captivity from their, you know, stewards. That his orcs need love. Sure. Compassion. Yeah, yeah. yeah that, no, the heart. yeah, there go. And no. Oh, you could have asked Robbie, do you think my wife will ever learn to love me? And then they'd ask which one. Oh. <laughs>